Hi, I'm Gray, and this is Hub Guitar. I'm here to tell you about gravity picks, which uh, most of which are made out of acrylic, uh, which is similar to V Pick, but I do think it's a, a different kind of acrylic, perhaps. So I've ordered a number of these over the last year, and uh, I've grown fond of some of them, and others not so much. One thing I like about the gravity picks, though, is that there's so many options in terms of the pick size and shape, and um, having grips drilled into it, and all kinds of things. So. Uh, really can go to the Gravity Picks web store and uh, find the perfect pick for just about anybody. So that's pretty cool. So these picks aren't cheap. I think they're about usually $5 a piece. So compared to the picks that are five cents a piece, they're certainly not cheap. Uh, but you don't need a whole lot of picks in your collection to get what you want. And they're highly customizable, which I like. So the two that I have uh, the most of, I've ordered the Classic Mini, which I've come to like probably the most. I also ordered the Sunrise Mini, which is similar, except it's got a bit of a more of a pointed edge to it. And uh, I didn't actually like that because I felt that the edge was really sharp and, and pointy and didn't really work that well for me. Um, but the Classic Mini ended up being a pretty good pick for me. Um, the acrylic picks, uh, when you're, if it's really hot and it's sweaty, I do feel that sometimes they feel a bit slippery in my hands because they're so kind of uh, shiny and um, it's kind of got a glass-like texture. Uh, it's not porous at all, so it, it does kind of get a little bit clammy sometimes. It's not so in the summer. I'm not a huge, huge fan of them, um, but they are great picks and I, that, I, that I generally like to play with, so I keep one in my pick pouch. I'm going to play a little bit with the, uh, this is the Sunrise, this one has that pointed edge. I don't know if it's just me, but I'm not a huge fan of that for some reason. Um, but the cool thing is with these picks is you can really get any shape or size that you want and try them all out for yourself. I also did get one of the, the uh, gold ones. These are like 20 bucks and these are supposed to be kind of on par with blue chip or something like that. Um, they do have a nice dark tone, which I like. Uh, but I didn't find that there was something that was so remarkable about this pick uh, that it would justify the 20 bucks. So it didn't end up becoming one of my favorite or most go-to picks. Another pick that I actually got, this is a free sample with an order. This is a 0.9 millimeters thick. So this is a thin little pick and it's, the, it's a kind of an oversized pick. So this ended up being really great for strumming chords. This actually has a great tone for strumming chords, but it's not super floppy. Uh, so it's just a little bit thin, a little bit flexible. So I, I strongly recommend this to any beginner that's trying to strum chords or anyone who wants to have a, a go-to pick that's really solid at strumming chords. I actually love it for that. So I keep one of these in my pick pouch. So I would definitely buy one of those again if I lost it. I also keep one of the 1.5 millimeter thick minis with me. Uh, the Sunrise I don't usually carry with me. And I also didn't end up using the gold pick a whole lot. Uh, but these are really great picks and uh, they're very highly customizable. So if you're one of those people that likes to kind of check out all the options and figure out what's the, the perfect pick for you, I'd strongly recommend you check out the uh, Gravity Picks web store and uh, try one for yourself.